All right. Um. All right. So, what is up? Um, I'm in the old store for one of the last few times, but I just found a really awesome um, tool to find parts that are potentially missing. So I'm just going to use the pick that I'm on right now as a um, template, I guess. So this is a nice tool if you're picking and a part's not in a drawer. So let's say I just pulled 5528 five, here and this, uh, this part I need, let's see myself here this part I need the five five uh, in five five two eight this part nine two 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 oh translate blue let's say it's not there it is here but just for this example um, so what basically what this will do is if you have an archive of all the brick store files you've uploaded which I recommend having and we have um, this uh, tool will allow you to search for files that have uh, a specific remark and a specific part number. So in this case, the remark 5528, the drawer number, and then the part number 92220. So you're going to need Notepad++. Um, and then you are going to go Control F and then Find in Files. And then set up your directory to wherever you store all your uploaded files. So just make sure they're all in one folder. Um, this is the Brick Store Uploaded Archive here. So um, you're going to want to have this expression here, uh, which I will have in the description. And then we're going to replace everything that says part in capitals with the part ID, which is 92220. So we do that one, and then this one. And then the remark um, is the drawer number, so capital D5528. And capital D5528, and we search it, and it's going to tell me files that have both that part and that um, remark. So this file here, uh, June 10 Trevor, so if we go there, uploaded archive to June, then it might be lower, yeah. It is Trevor 1. Open this. And you can see the part in question is right there. So if this were missing, what I would do is just sort this file by remarks. And then all the remarks here would be drawer numbers that were being worked on during this file. So I can just search these drawers and then find the part. Um, so this is a good way to track down missing stuff or if you want to know how long a part was there, or who uploaded it, or, or something like that, or you know when you uploaded it, when you made the file, what you priced it at. Um, yeah, basically if you just want to find the file that a part came from that sold, uh, this will do it really quickly. And unless you have millions of files, there's going to be very few matches, or if you upload in a, a different way than me. But yeah, so basically that expression just shows you files that have that exact drawer number and that exact part somewhere. Um, and then just uh, gives the matches. So a uh, little tip here on Thursday to help out people who have an uploaded archive. And if you don't, I recommend you start one. Um, download to Notepad++ and this expression here will be in the description. Thanks for watching and have a good one.